My family to me means everything. Because without family, you're nothing. My name is Lakeisha Boston. I'm 38 years old and I'm from Baltimore, Maryland. Growing up, my mom, once she had got sick, I was taking care of her. I moved to Dry Hill. Like cook for her, rub her feet when she want her feet rubbed, do her hair when she want her hair done. Like I just used to do everything. And then once she passed, like a year or so went on, and I was like, see if I can get my CNA, GNA license. When I'm at work, I look at them as one of my family members. And I do the best I can for them because I know that they need me. And if it was my mom, it was a friend, anybody, I'll do the same. Our grandmother was the exact same way as her. She was always the nice one. Everyone loved her and everyone would come to her when they needed anything. So it was no surprise that she went into a job where she would care for the elderly. Keisha has a deep connection with the residents, deep personal connection with the residents. Just because she has a beautiful spirit, she has a beautiful heart, so it just comes out naturally for her. She doesn't fake it, it's just there. This is not a job that you just do for a paycheck. Their job is brutal, it's hard work. They're constantly called by numerous residents to help them with incontinence care, dressing, lifting, ambulating, turning, wound care. I wash every single person's feet from head to toe. When I'm giving them a beer bath, a shower, or whatever, I make sure that's what I do. Because I do it for myself, so why wouldn't I do? And then they love me. Sometimes I sit in the room, talk to them. Because I know it's lonely. Some of them have families that come visit, some don't. She works so hard. I know there's times where she just needs to let everything go and relax. He'll be in the downstairs and I'll just be like, I want to go to the movie. So he'll be like, all right, come on, don't care what we going to see, he with it. She keeps you going, she keeps you laughing, she keeps you smiling. She's like just energetic. And this is every day, it never changes with her. Truly, a CNA does have to have a heart of gold and a thick skin. They provide emotional support and encouragement, such as end-of-life care. That's difficult for anyone, and it's difficult for a CNA. I didn't cry so many days from people passing because I get so attached to everybody. And they tell me, stop getting attached, but I can't help it. I just. Like, I take pride in what I do for people. When I think about what Keisha does, she's the backbone of the business. She's the skeleton. One patient at a time. It's her hard work. It's what she sees every day in order to provide the excellent care that we give. I know when I come in the next day that I'm off and my next day of work, they be like, you wasn't here yesterday. They be missing me.